Zespół szkolno-przedszkolny im. Michała Kajki w Dąbrówce po raz pierwszy bierze udział w projekcie o takim międzynarodowym zasięgu. W dodatku jesteśmy jego koordynatorem. Przez pięć dni gościliśmy partnerów z Grecji i Turcji. Nauczyciele wraz z młodzieżą przyjechali, abyśmy mogli wspólnie realizować projekt pod tytułem Wyjście z klasą Steam na zewnątrz. Głównym tematem w Polsce było globalne ocieplenie i jego skutki. Dzisiejszy wywiad będzie podsumowaniem naszej pięciodniowej działalności. Posłuchajmy. Do you think Erasmus projects are necessary? Yeah. Uh, no, but uh, it's a great experience and the students get to experience how life in other countries is. Um, and it's a great experience for teachers too, to meet other teachers and talk about the, their topic. And what about you? Do you think Erasmus projects are necessary? Uh, like the Erasmus projects are uh, like I think no, but uh, Erasmus projects are good projects because uh, the people at different countries uh, get learned each other's uh, cultures, uh, and that's a part of a learning. So yeah, it's a great, great, great activity. Mm -hmm. And uh, what do you think? What are the differences between your school and Polish school? Uh, Polish school is closer to nature than my school. My school is in the in the city, mm -hmm. and your school is in a forest. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, also, your school uh, is bigger than mine, and it has only one floor. Mm -hmm. Our has two. Mm -hmm. And you, uh, you got higher school. We don't. Mm -hmm. And what about you? What are the differences between Polish school and your school? Uh, our school uh, is in city, got four floors. Mm -hmm. uh, like it, uh, um, the Polish school is kind of small actually, because mm -hmm. uh, it got one f floor and uh, like the corridors are must be just in one floor and the uh, hundred students are just uh, in one floor so uh, like yeah it's kind of small mm -hmm. and what do you like about poland um first the cold weather mm -hmm. it's not very cold but it's nice uh, second the we are in Masuria, the land of a thousand lakes mm -hmm. and it's great to see all these lakes together. And third, the hospitable people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Okay, and what about you? What do you like about Poland most? Um, like everything. Poland is a beautiful place. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got nice people in nice mm -hmm. buildings, mm -hmm. nice nature. Like uh, everything looks like nice, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what benefits for your school can you see after Erasmus project? Uh, uh, I think that we won't see a difference from the first Erasmus project. Mm -hmm. it, uh, we must have more and more to get a difference on the quality of our students. Mm -hmm. uh, that's it. Mm -hmm. And what can you tell us about this, this question? Uh, I don't see any difference uh, in my school, I think. Like, m maybe some minuses in the graduation system and the uh, teaching system in the pond, but uh, not that... F uh, mm, not that very much. Like, I don't see any difference. Mm -hmm. And you guys, what would you like to tell the listeners? That if you are in a foreign country, you you must visit Poland. It's a great place, mm -hmm. and especially Masuria. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, po Poland is a beautiful place, uh, like especially the oceans. Like I liked it, so uh, may love it and spend the time with your uh, nearest and uh, like. Friends.
Mm -hmm. And tell us our names. George. Okay, and you are from? Greece. Okay, and your name is? Hassan, I'm from Turkey. Okay. George, Hassan, thank you very much. So, hello, Jota. Hello, uh, Mehmet. Hello, Paweł. Hello, Paweł. Okay, and how do you feel in Poland, Jota? I feel excited. It's the first time I come to your beautiful country and I really enjoy it. Do you, Mehmet? Uh, I'm very pleased to be here. Uh, I like your country and uh, I saw many things during my program. Mm -hmm. And Jota, can you tell us uh, what kind of experience w will go with you to Greece? As I already said to my sons, it's something I will never forget. There are so many things that I saw, experienced, uh, learned with mm -hmm. my students that I will never forget. Mm -hmm. It was a full week uh, with so many things uh, to see and learn. I'm really excited. Okay. And you, Mehmet? Uh, I'm really excited too. Uh, we have experienced many things during the program. And uh, we are really uh, glad uh, about your hospitality. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, uh, we, ha we had the chance uh, to see your culture mm -hmm. during this uh, program. Mm -hmm. And um, when I come to Turkey, go to Turkey, sorry, uh, I will talk about many things to my students. And uh, during the history, Poland and uh, Turkey has a good relationship. And, uh, and uh, I told you, you know, there is a Polish village in Turkey. Mm -hmm. And uh, I will visit them also. Mm -hmm. And I will talk about this uh, journey. Mm -hmm. So, uh, that's all. Okay, and let's talk about uh, our program. Uh, Jota, what can you tell us about uh, the program that we prepared for you and what did you like best? Well, I found that it was a pretty complete program full of activities and things to learn, not only for the students, but also for us, the teachers. Mm -hmm. um, I liked the most... Uh, when I get to contact with your students. Mm -hmm. I find it very interesting. As a teacher, I see things that I want to say to my colleagues in Greece. Um, I see methods, things in your school, in the classrooms that I really liked. So I think mostly the cultural part for me mm -hmm. and uh, the experience of uh, being a teacher in another school, in another country, was the most exciting. Mm -hmm. And what about you, Mehmet? And uh, yeah, during the program, uh, I liked your uh, cultural and the natural uh, trips. Mm -hmm. uh, I love your nature, the forest, especially, and the lakes. Uh, they are beautiful. And also we had the chance to see that uh, your uh, education system and uh, your methods also. Also our program uh, teaches us uh, the uh, environment, uh, recycling mm -hmm. things mm -hmm. uh, we have learned and your uh, cultural activities at the school Today, uh, we, we, we burn the doll mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> to welcome the uh, spring. Spring, okay. And it, it was amazing, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what would you like to tell our listeners? Thank you for the hospitality. We really enjoyed our stay in your beautiful town. We hope to come back. Thank you. Thank mm -hmm. you too. Mm -hmm. And Mehmet, what would you like to say to our listeners? Uh, I also would like to thank to all of them. They are friendly uh, and the hos uh, be uh, hospitality and their foods. <laughs> 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 I like your foods. 
Okay. And I will come. Uh, I'm planning to come here in summer again mm -hmm. oh. with my family. Okay. So, thank you very much for the interview. Thank you too. Th thank you very much that you came to visit us to visit Poland, and see you soon. Thank you. We're waiting you. for you in Greece now. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.